Hello friends, this video on hydrogen part 19 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. The question is what do we mean by autoprotolysis of water? What is the significance? So autoprotolysis auto means self ionization of water. That means I have H2O and H2O, it will form S3 plus and OH minus. So this will one will act as acid, one will act as base, one will gain H plus ions, one will lose H plus ions. That means I can say that this also means water is amphoteric substance. Right? It is in fact as both S3 and base. Correct? So I have my water, it acts as both acid and base. So if you see this, let's see example where it acts as acid. So water if you react with NH3, it gives NH4 plus plus OH minus. So here water acts as acid. Same water if you react with let's suppose H2S, it gives you H3O plus plus SH minus. So here it acts as base. The question says consider the reaction of water with Fp and suggest in terms of oxidation and reduction which species is oxidized and which gets reduced. So the reaction is very simple. Chlorine plus water will give you oxygen plus H plus plus F minus. Let's balance this. So two oxygens will be two more hydrogens. Yeah, this is my balanced reaction. Now if you see the oxidation state is 0, here it is 1, minus 1 for fluorine. So the fluorine is getting reduced, right? Fluorine is getting reduced. Oxygen was minus 2, it became 0. Oxygen is getting oxidized. So oxygen is a reducing agent, that means right, is reducing agent. And fluorine is, you can say, oxidizing agent, you can say. Fluorine is oxidizing agent. You can't say oxygen, you can say hold water only. Because we don't have oxygen taking part here. Whole water. So water is a reducing agent here and fluorine is an oxidizing agent. What is the causes of permanent and temporary hardness? We know that. See for temporary, we have in both we have calcium and magnesium cation. But here we have HCO3 minus ion anions. For permanent, also we have calcium or magnesium cation, but in case of anion, we have chloride and sulfate. Correct. So it is calcium chloride, calcium sulfate, magnesium chloride, magnesium sulfate. Here we have calcium hydroxide, hydro calcium hydrogen carbon, magnesium hydrogen carbon, carbonate. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.